Hey guys, I'm out here working on the 57, doing a little paint stripping here. So uh, I got one of these, they're basically, it's a copy of a uh, Eastwood, uh, what is it, SCT I think they call it. Uh, and then I got a Harbor Freight abrasive wheel for it. And uh, this is on back order, it just came in. So I'm stripping off the paint and the rust here on this uh, this particular side. I'm not going to do down there because I'm cutting all of that out. So uh, that'll be replaced with patch panels. So I figured I'd uh, I got these wheels in. I'd give it a try. I've had this buffer for a while. It came with a wheel, but it was too fine. It did not uh, take off uh, what I hoped it would, you know. So we. Uh, uh, ordered one of these uh, abrasive things. They're they're pretty expensive. They're like twenty nine dollars per per drum. So, but this is the result I'm getting. Uh, my car has got this is the plum original color. The uh, uh, well, it's not plum. What is it? It's uh, pearl or something. And they call it and uh, dusk dusk pearl. And then uh, it had blue, and then it had a coat of white thrown over top of it which I think is that Imran so but uh, trying to clean it up get a little bit done here as I got some free time uh, just uh, kind of working where I can do things where I don't have to take a lot of setup time to to knock it out and then I wanted to try these wheels out I was uh, just sometimes you know you you're dying to know how it's going to work so anyways uh, just figured I'd give you a little short update on this uh, as we go along here so Keep the rubber side down. Talk to you later.